Let's create a macro which will refresh this pivot table and pivot chart both. Start recording macro in absolute mode. Macro name is refresh pivot. Press OK button. Right click inside pivot table and click on refresh. Stop macro recording. Go to source data worksheet. Delete row containing south data. We have changed the source data. Go back to sheet 1. Go to insert ribbon tab. Insert an oval shape. Label on the shape can be refresh pivot. Format the label with bigger font, center alignment and bold formatting. Right click on the shape, click on assign macro, select refresh pivot macro and click OK button. Hover on the shape and you can see a hand icon. Hand icon denotes that macro is ready for use on this shape. Click on the shape. Both pivot table and pivot chart have been refreshed with a single click.